Hello, this is Mark Wildman of Wildman Athletica here with Amina the Warrior, our Russian international wushu champion. And we are going to work on some attack defend drills today with staff versus baseball bat. We have talked about these drills before. This is the most basic drill that you should do every time you do training like this, several times a week for the most part. We're gonna do it first with the staff, then I'm going to convert to a bat. She is going to attack me any way she wants, and we are not going to move our feet. She doesn't tell me what attacks are coming. I learn to observe, orient, decide, and act, and line my body up behind the strikes. Come on, give me a little pepper. There we go. She learns to swing. She learns, and I learn to block. Pause. Very simple drill. Learn to put something between you and the other guy. She doesn't tell me what's coming. That's the point. She swings anywhere on the outside of that curve. She learns to line up different types of moves in different ways. And I learn to not get hit in the face. We are now going to convert it over to a baseball bat. Every time you change the implement, start over with these drills. The weight is different, the length is different, how you grip it may be different depending on what it is. So the more odd objects that you can use for this, the better it goes. So the model of bat I'm using is a Brooklyn Crusher from Cold Steel. It is model CS29, indestructible bat. What you notice is the second you go to something like this, a lot of people, no matter how much training they've done with a staff, will kind of forget what they're doing for a minute because your brain considers this to be a very different thing than a staff. Center balance is different, the diameter is different, the grip is different. So I'm gonna hold palm away, and I'm gonna hold palm away, just like I did with the staff originally. She's going to attack, and I am going to learn to block over and over and over and over again. She learns how to hit as hard as possible. And I, there we go. That's some violence. Excellent violence. Pause. What I just did was this grip, right hand at the bottom of the bat. We need to do an equal amount of time with my left hand on the bottom of the bat. She was in right, I was in right, now she is in left, and I will be in left. So there's actually right, right, left, 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 right, and right, left. Make them big and clean and sexy every time. Pause. Simple drill first. Make sure that every time you change implement, you start your training over without moving your feet because every time you change the width or the grip on something like this, it does affect how your brain operates very, very slightly and your brain will become unconfident in what it's doing. So every time we do these drills, we're rebuilding the confidence in the most basic human movements, the big old attacks, and the big old defenses from the absolute beginning every time. The more objects we train with for the absolute basics of attack and defense, the better our base athletic skill can be. 